What's up guys, it's Drip Drop bringing you the drippest drop I can find. Hope you guys are doing well and I want you guys to know that you are loved. Remember, it is November, so let me know down in the comments what you are thankful for this month. And also, don't forget, you're supposed to be thankful all year long. In today's video, we're gonna open up this Fusion Strike. Whoa, there's a puppy. Uh -huh. In today's video, we're gonna open up the new Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box from Fusion Strike and a regular Fusion Strike ETB, and we're gonna pin them up against one another and see which one has the better pulls. The Pokemon Center might have an upper hand because it has an extra two packs, but the Pokemon Center pulls for us haven't been that great in the past. So let's go ahead and continue on to the rest of the video and see if this Pokemon Center box can't redeem the other Pokemon Center boxes that we have gotten in the past. All right, guys, quick little reminder. If you guys enjoy watching this content and you want to see more of it, go ahead and punch the like button, slap that subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything. So let's go ahead and hop into the uh, opening and see what we get. All right, guys, here we go. We have the regular Elite Trainer Box from Fusion Track and the Fusion Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box. So we have Pokemon Center, regular. We're gonna go ahead and break into the regular first because we're gonna save the best for last, hopefully. So let's go ahead and break in to this one right here. We'll go ahead and get this knob going. Boom, there we go. All right, so if you watched my most recent Fusion Strike opening with the build and battle boxes, I opened near, you know, 15 plus packs and only got two regular V's in those packs. Um, and you guys know that I play the TCG, so I'm always looking for other types of V-Maxes, as you can see right here. You guys can see the nice little art inside right there. Here, let me go ahead and take it up. So as you can see right here, we have the Mew art, the Gengar art, the Boltund art, and the Genesect art in the inside of the ETB packaging. So that's pretty cool. But as I was saying that I'm always looking to get some good playable cards whenever I'm opening these packs and uh, I didn't pull that many good ones so there we go we have we have some hypno rings going on right here some hypno rings and then we have our energies you guys can have this code right here it's code for the elite trainer box we have the mu sleeves nice mu sleeves we got some special condition markers in there we have these sweet die. I'm going to show you these dies. The cotton candy dies. So look at that. Look at these wonderful dies. I love these hit die. I wish they were metal hit die. It'd be even cooler. Then we have our fusion strike die right there. Looks really good. So we got that. And then we have our eight packs of fusion strike. Pull rates in Fusion Strike are very, very low. But that's all right, we don't open it to pull anything, we open it for the packs. And for you guys, because you guys enjoy watching these type of openings. Clearly, since you guys are watching it right now. So there's a code card right there, and I think I saw a peak of something. So we might have actually gotten a little bit lucky. So we have Metal Energy, Hariyama Single Strike, Breloom, Cross Switcher. <clears throat> so this is a cool card. You must play two Cross Switcher cards at once. Switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon. If you do, switch your active Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon. So it's kind of kind of acts like a free boss, but you have to use two of them at the same time. We got Phantump, Snorlax, Snom. We got Dreepy, Makohita. A reverse holo cloister and hey, 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 I take everything back about the pool rates. No, they still remain, but hey, we got incredibly lucky with this Celebi V alternate art on the first pack out of an ETB, baby. So that is really awesome. We have Celebi V alternate R. We have for one grass energy leaflet dance. Attach any number of your grass energy cards from your hand to your Pokemon in any way you like. And then we have for one grass, one colorless slash back. Switch to Pokemon with one of your benched Pokemon for 60. So very beautiful card here. I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve this baby up. Yes, we got incredibly lucky with that 
alternate art pool right there. I am very thankful for that. Very thankful for that pool right there. All right, let's go ahead and head on into the next pack. So we got the second pack of Fusion Strike. Let's see if we can't land anything absolutely huge again. That'd be incredible if we got the uh, one of those really good ETBs. We got Psychic Energy, Sydney, another Cross Switcher, Croconaw, very awesome second gen starter. Or well, Croconaw is not the starter, but Totodile is, but very cool line. One of my favorite lines in the Pokemon realm. We got Sharpedo and hey, nice, we got Dragapult. So we got some of those in our build and battle ETBs. I mean, our build and battle boxes. So we might be able to build this, uh, build this deck in real life. There was a lot of bees right there. There's a lot of bees being said. One, two, three, four to the front. All right, let's go electric, dark, dark energy. We have the worst card in the set. Toga tomorrow, Toga tomorrow. Schoolboy, Zorora, not Zorora, Zorua. Always get that one mixed up. We got a very realistic Caterpie. Drillber, Shinx, Reverse Hollow Musharna, and an Acel Gore. I got too many Acel Gores out of those building battle boxes. By too many, I got three. Next pack. Guys can have that code right there. Hope you guys are enjoying this opening as I am so far. I always enjoy opening packs. And I mean, obviously I'll enjoy opening packs and getting good cards, but I just enjoy opening packs all together. I think it's very fun. We got Klefki, Trubbish, Reverse Hollow Fusion Strike Energy, and hey, we got a Single Strike Brelum V. Single Strike Brelum V, pretty cool card right there. That is two hits out of an ETB. I can't remember the last time I got two hits out of an ETB. So, uh, I mean, that's uh, incredible, actually. We got Lightning Energy, Zororark, Semipore, Metapod, Toxel, Totodile, Buneri, Clubopus, Tynamo, Reverse Holo Galarian Berserker, and a Huntail for the rare. With a pretty cool ability, Single Strike Jammer, your opponent's Single Strike Pokemon's attack cost one energy more, or one colorless, but one energy more. I got three more packs left. One, two, three, four to the front. Fire energy, fighting energy, Excadrill, Dub wool. We got SpongeBob gloves, Fay Lynx, Choodle on a Noodle. Well, not on a Noodle, this one. Volaby, Dew Potter, Meowth, Skarmory, Gramble. Oh, that's the rare. Ha! Huh. That really, uh, really snuck up on me there. All right, second to last pack here. Let's see if we can't get that second to last pack magic. There you go, you guys. You can have that code card right there. I'm keeping some of the code cards because I do play the TCG and I'm trying to get some decks ready for you guys um, for the new Fusion Strike set. We got Chili, Silon, and Caress, Copper Jaw, Mankey, Kalancher, Growlithe, Stuffle, Sigalith, Reverse Hollow Toxtricity, and a Luxray for the rare. So we got the last pack coming up. Are we gonna get another hit or are we gonna get another dud? We will see. We still have the Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box to open. So we have some time. Now, if we don't pull an alternate art out of this uh, Pokemon Center ETB, I don't know if uh, it's gonna be able to catch up. We got Beware, Skaters Park, Low Punny, Indeedy, Growlithe, Phalanx, more Peko, very angry more Peko, Caterpie, another skate park, and an Azumarill. So these are the pulls right here out of that ETB. We got that Celebi V 
alternate art, which is uh, pretty incredible. So we're very, very happy with that. Let's move on to the Pokemon Center box. So the same art is inside this box right here. So we don't have to look inside that, but there are a few different items that you can get inside the Pokemon Center box. So I believe in this Pokemon Center box, there's an extra set of sleeves. I'm not sure if the dice are any different, but you, you but you also get two extra packs in this uh, box. Whoa, we got our damage counter, not our damage counters, but our special condition markers. This is the same right here. Got that player's handbook, two sets of sleeves. The dice are the same. Forgot to show you guys the dividers in the last one, but these are uh, different. So that we have this blue, just like the outside. The other ones are purple. And then we have our two different sets of sleeves right here. So we have our sweet Genesect sleeves and our Muse sleeves. And just like the dividers, the other ones are purple, as you can see earlier. All right, guys, so I kind of missed something whenever I went into this. I forgot to take out the coin. So this is Editing Joshua filming this to show you guys how beautiful this glittery Mew VMAX coin is. I think it is pretty rad. So there you go. And then we have our 10 packs, or at least it should be 10 packs. We'll go ahead and count them up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten packs. Let's go ahead and open these babies up. So we got the first pack. Can we get a little bit of fat first pack magic again? A little bit of first pack magic again. That'd be pretty cool. You guys can have that code right there. One, two, three, four to the front. We're gonna get uh, fire energy because we're gonna get some fire pools in this ETB. We got Sydney, another cross switcher, Mudkip, Sandshrew, Kufant, Impidimp, Snom, a reverse hollow power tablet, and hey, we got a Cinderace V Max. So very cool card right here. Uh, single strike, it is for one fire energy and four colorless. We have G Max Fireball for 230. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now burned. During your next turn, the Pokemon cannot attack. So very, very cool card. I enjoy this, uh, this ball of flame, this sun that the Cinderace is standing on. You go ahead and hit up the second pack right here. And let me know guys, um, also down in the comments, uh, what pulls have you gotten or what pulls are you looking forward to getting? I'm really looking for the uh, Muse. I really think the Muse are a very cool addition in this set as I mean, obviously the, uh, it's the poster child of the set. We got a Pukey Mewkey, really cool card right here. I mean, I enjoy this card right here with the ability pitch a Pukey Mewkey. Once during your turn, if this Pokemon is in your hand, you may reveal it and put it into the bottom of your deck. If you do, draw a card. You can't use more than one of these abilities each turn. So you can just put this into your deck and be able to use it whenever you have it. As an extra draw, we have Helioptal, Wooloo, Gossifleur, Mudkip, Shinx, and a Zorora for the rare there. Get into this next pack here. See if we can't pull any more alternate arts. That'd be pretty cool. We got Gengar, Gengar alternate art. We got Lightning Energy, Croconaw, Exegadrill, Double, Jigglypuff Durant, Pansir, Minum, Reverse Hollow Meowth, and a Butterfree Hollow Rare. So also very cool card. I enjoy that. It's a pretty cool looking card. Now, I mean, I'll be honest, if I pull it more times, it won't be that cool, but with this set being as big as it is, I mean, it's gonna be hard to, uh, you think it'd be hard to get doubles, but I don't. I really don't think it is. All right, we got Grass Energy, Eldegoss, Power Tablet, Beware, 
Sanshrew, Q Font, Epidemp, Snom, Onyx, Reverse Holo Heatmore, and a Dodrio V. Dodrio V. I didn't even know this card was in the set, to be honest, until I pulled it on uh, on the online game. I've been opening some packs on the online game as well. I think it's a pretty cool card. I don't think it's too playable, but it does uh, it does show Dodria's personalities uh, pretty well. Angry, angry, and angrier. All right, or I should say, angry, angrier, and angriest. You got dark energy, SpongeBob gloves, Frost moth. Semi-Seer, Voltoy, Galarian Cursola, Quillfish, Vulpix, Chansey, Nice, a Reverse Holo Pukimuku, and a Gudra for the rare. Hope you guys are enjoying this opening so far. If you do, go ahead and smash that like button. Alright, we have Steel Energy. And that, I mean, hitting the like button does help me out so much. Shauna shows people that uh, you like it. We got Durant, Panseer, Minin. It also just shows your support. We got Boltoy, Reverse Hollow, Meltan, and an Evelto. But feel free to, uh, not if you don't uh, feel like it. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, Gene? We got the next Fusion Strike pack. Oh, look at that more Peko. There's a code card for you guys right there if you want that. Mm, fire energy. We got water energy, the opposite. I'm really good at guessing the opposite. We got Crossiever, Simi Sage, Sydney, 42 Wallaby Way, Sydney, more Peko, Skarmory, Shelmet, Plusel, Moon. Reverse Holo Sizzly Pete and hey, nice. We got a Mew, Mew V Max. One of the best cards in the Fusion Strike set. So we have Mew V Max for 310 HP, Fusion Strike Pokemon. We have for two colorless energy cross Fusion Strike. Choose one of your bench Fusion Strike Pokemon's attacks and use it as this attack. Then we have for two psychic energy. Max Miracle for 130. This attack's damage isn't affected by any effects of your opponent's active Pokemon. So this card is one of the best cards in the Fusion Strike set, and that cross Fusion Strike is used quite a bit in partner with the new Genesect V. Very cool card. We're going to sleeve this baby up as well. All right, guys, we got three packs left. Let's see if we can't get anything out of the last three packs of this ETB. Let's see, sometimes I confuse myself and I completely forget what I'm doing. We got another Metal Energy, Power Tablets, Beware, Drekloak, Snom, we got a Dreepy, Makahita, Uruka D, Galarian Darmaka, Reverse Holo of Vikavolt, and a Elix Ray for the rare. Two more packs left. Can we land another alternate art or can we land another VMAX of some sort? I would love, love, love to get one of the Gengar VMAXs. Because I really do enjoy uh, the, how cool the card looks. We got Swadloom, Kramomatic, Skate Park, Phantom, Snorlax, Snom, Dreepy, and a Makahita. Reverse Hall of Frostmoth and a Huntail for the rare. All right, guys, we got one pack left. Drum roll, please. Don't start yet. All right, you guys can have this code card right here. All right, we have the last pack here. The very last pack. We got Lightning Energy, Copperaja. Zororark, Semipore, Mudkip, Caterpie, More Peko, Less Peko, Eevee, Reverse Holo Electros, 
And I want to let you guys know that whatever happens next, I'm not going to let it change me. I'm not going to let it get to me. I want you guys to know that I still love you, and I'm hoping that you're loving this video. And we got a Grand Bull for the rare. All right, guys, so this was the uh, this was the opening. And the first ETB, guys, we got this Brelum V and the Celebi V alternate art. And in the Pokemon Center exclusive box, we got the Dodrio V, the Cinderace V Max, and the Mew V Max. So I'll let you guys let me know down in the comments who do you think won. I think it's a tie, maybe? No, definitely the Alt Art. The Alt Art won, so it's the regular ETB that I got out of Walmart. All right, so I'll let you guys choose as well. What do you think won? Um, other than that, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, just like always, I'll see you guys in the next video.